Hi, James here. Recently I just got asked about how I did the glow on this tower. I also used the same kind of glow in my game Mighty Marvel. I'm going to show you how to do this on the URP pipeline, so the Universal Render Pipeline. Now what I've done is simply created a new scene from the Universal Render Pipeline template. Now this has everything set up, so I'm going to show you how to do it first of all on this scene. And then I'm going to show you the things you might have to do if, if your scene doesn't have all of this set up. So at the moment, I just have created a simple material and there's nothing in it at the moment. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab one of my textures and put it into the base map. You can now see that there's some color. Now in order to get the glow, you need to use the emission. And I have an emission map here. You need to click the tick here and then drop the emission map in. Now if you have a look at the emission map, it's simply black where you don't want it to glow and white where you do want it to glow. That's right? simple as that. If you want the whole model to glow, you don't actually need a map, but for most of the things that I do, I only want a little bit of the model to glow. So next, you want to go to your HDR and basically all you need to do is give it an intensity of more than one and give it some color. And there you go, that's all you need to do as a basic way of doing it. Now, at the moment, if yours isn't glowing, there's a couple of things that you'll need to do. The first thing you need is your glow, you need to make sure your scene has a global volume and add it if you don't have it. And then you add the override bloom. And you want to make sure that your intensity is at least one or whatever your intensity is, plus the intensity in your HDR, will have to total more than one to get the glow. The next thing on you is, you want to make sure that on your main camera, your post-processing is enabled. And you can see here what pipeline you're using. And just so I'm using the URP height fidelity. So click on that. And you just want to make sure the HDR is enabled. So long as you do those things, you'll get that glow. So that's how easy it is to add glow to any objects in Unity on the URP pipeline. Hope you found this useful and if you did please subscribe like and comment it really helps me grow the channel and i would really love to make more of these videos hope you have a great day bye